Fair, spoiler-free reviews of the newest films. Vaughn on Movies. Brought to you by Twirlia. Boy, have I got a treat for you with this early review. Edgar Wright, director of Hot Fuzz and Shaun of the Dead, brings to life the Scott Pilgrim graphic novels. Michael Sarah plays the title character, a 22-year-old bassist for the small-time rock band Sex bob while at a party, he meets his dream girl, Ramona Flowers, played by Mary Elizabeth Winstead, with revolving hair colors. In order to continue courting Ramona, Scott has to defeat her seven evil exes in Mortal Kombat. This movie is unlike anything I've ever seen before. And no, I did not think I would be instead watching Wall Street Money Never Sleeps. The world's toughest movie critic. From the moment you see the Universal logo rendered with NES graphics and sounds, you know this is going to be a bold film. From start to finish, Scott Pilgrim vs. The World is a joyful bombardment of sight gags and quips that draw inspiration from video games and anime. Oftentimes, these jokes come at such a dizzying pace, it's difficult to fully appreciate them. As many of you know, I'm not thrilled by Michael Sarah's less than diverse performances, but he, along with the rest of the cast, are hilarious with deadpan and over-the-top deliveries. For the most part, I would credit the writing. Oh, there's nothing subtle about Scott Pilgrim. As much as it may seem annoying to have explicitly described characters accompanied by on-screen titles, the way these titles mimic the heads-up display found in video games is part of the fun. And I hope you like your metaphors to the extreme, because here, fighting for someone's love means going Super Saiyan on some fools. And because this is Vaughn on Movies, I have to give some complaints. There are so many kinetic effects that it did wear me out. Also, the world is a complete fantasy, and oftentimes the film has fun with this. However, there are times where things appear to be overlooked. For instance, there's a concert where Scott says, Hey, there's Todd. And Ramona replies, I know. Well, so what? I don't remember anybody talking about Todd. Todd is, of course, one of Ramona's seven evil exes. And one of those is a surprise to Ramona, so I don't know how she knew there'd be seven. Another ex is a movie star, so you can imagine he has better things to do than to be taking orders from someone else. And before I give up my final score, I have to give a shout out to Rob Sosado2500 for answering this week's Pop Quiz Hotshot trivia question. Be sure to look for those on Twitter, Sundays, midnight, central time. Scott Pilgrim vs. The World is not for everyone, especially if you're unfamiliar with geek culture. It's very much a live-action Dragon Ball Z, and I applaud the way Wright is able to make it work. Extra kudos to the editors and CGI artists. And on that note, should you see Scott Pilgrim, stick around till the end. I give it three and a half out of four stars. I'll see you guys next time. Thank <laughs> you.